Live a below. Hi guys, Auntie Dana here down by Little Miss. She, me tell her to me I come from morning, she don't know what time when. But me I just here for officially make Little Miss know that Auntie Dana finished with her, the journey has finished. So we're going around to help Little Miss. Yeah. <laughs> the video Little Miss to say the final goodbye from the Good Deeds program. We didn't want to do it more different, but the rainfall and this um I made the plan to do it Monday, get a little balloon and tie up here. So, but the balloon thing don't work because of the rain and everything was going. So, we just agreed so she can't in her house that says rain and fall. She alright because she did afraid to sleep in the boat. And she said, I don't want to see up nothing, but I tell her to sleep in her house. So, come with me, guys. Auntie Dana, going with me. What's the name? She wants to hear my mouth. Let's come in. 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 Live, I mean, living 3.6. Eh? 3.6. Oh, yeah, I said, Tina, pass this. So, before we even go into the commis house, I want to have a little speech. Watch a crowd that come. Look, hold on, little. Little miss, come out here. So, I'm going to answer that attack before we do anything else. We're going to show them. So, um, we have to take off the mask and we have to stifle. Time for it. So we never planned it this way, little miss. I had planned to come on Monday, which you know, yeah. have a little balloon and a little ceremony, but God forbid they locked down the country, so I couldn't get to do it no other time, and I couldn't, I can't get to come till next week. So I said, no, let me take off little miss and Miss Marcia off the program today. So little miss, um, little miss came to me seeking assistance more than once, and I keep saying to little miss, for those who don't know, little miss, I know your time yet, don't you? Yeah. I say, me have other people that deal with now. But at the time, me know that house did burn down, but me never know the living condition. So one day now, uh, me I give out some pampas. Some Uggies did carry some pampas. A uh, pampas. Mm -hmm. Did carry some pampas from a Nenisha. The girl in the Nenisha, you see them with their students say, Miss say, Nenisha, what you do with pampas? And she say, Miss Dana, I know me, me, I look the pampas them fine now. I look at me so under somebody this year, but baby, not now go and fear our house, but no one fear, but see where she live. And I say, eh, well, me no know, she said, me don't know, I beg you, this year, if you can do help her. At the time, at that time, I she say, Nenisha have one yeah, sister and her aunt, and Nenisha come on the program. I did a talk about it on the live and person reach out. But long story short, I remember the night when I come and I the old house down the gully, they say you're there. And when I come and I see a water come and I come and I say, This girl keep on and come and my house and I say, Miss Dana, you can't help me to get five now, one room for me and my two children because you see me the depth of my foot and my house burned down and you switch part me live. And the first time I came and I blessed her with a new donation and something persons were touched by her story and Donors came on board and donated to Likomis, and this is the result of Likomis' donation. Likomis, we want to give God thanks first and foremost. Um, I am talking to you as, with a bittersweet moment. <laughs> Not because I like to cry, I want to cry, Likomis, but when I stand up here on this pattern to see the tear down and the tribulation, it, Sleepless night, the, the amount of time coming on the live and asking for help for you. At one point, you don't know if you remember, you got one party and you get stagnant. And I said, God, God, I can't make the commis house not finish up. Um, because the donor them stop donating to the commis. At one point, I don't say, No, I'm going to move by faith and trust material from Miss Debbie and ask the donor them to pay it back so that the commis house can finish. And we want to give God thanks first and foremost for allowing me um, to use my mouth and a platform where your donors trust me enough to reach out and help me to make this dream. These are tears of joy, Blanca people. When I look back on the journey, 
so that little miss can have a house little miss as i stand here and i stand in the gap for all the donors them who donate me not dress up like a church girl to them coming like a ragamuffin because rain and fall and me don't feel for come out so i want to give god all the glory i have prayed so many morning for this house and all the houses that i have been doing and every prayer that i have prayed and every eye water that i have dropped god has bring it forth to pass father god on this journey you have placed me on this journey for a specific reason and you have given me a mandate to carry out on this platform and the houses that I have been building. Lord God, you see the Shambalaks and the Tobias spirit that has risen up against me on this journey. Father God, you sit high and you look down low this evening. That I am my name and my character. I have, have been tainted for things that I have not done or things that I have not said. But I still stood strong because I know that you are the conquering liar in the tribe of Judah. You are my rock of Gibraltar. You are the one that I go to each morning and you are the one that I go to each night. Mighty God, you have allowed me. To use my mouth to be a blessing to others. I always pray and ask God. Say, Father God, may I beg you to bless me so that I can be a blessing to other persons. I never yet come to you and tell you to bless me so I can stay with the blessing and be selfish. And this evening, Father God, I just want to reverence you. I just want to, if I never tell you thanks before, which I do it a million times, I just want to tell you thanks here. I am asking you this evening, Jesus, to let the Holy Spirit rest, remain, and abide on this path of ground. Let there be no no confusion let there be nothing that is not of you to enter this surrounding this house this dwelling this home that you have used me to provide for this young miss right here father god you said we must ask and it shall be given and i remember the countless days and the countless night that i am on my knee praying i remember some sundays when i'm at church and pastor preach and i'm and fasting and me i say remember little miss remember siloni remember shante remember this Remember that because all of the house them depend me and all me up in what I have to finish them. And I remember saying to you, God, you know, give me nothing to do when we can't finish. And today, God, we just want to tell you thanks. I just want to tell you thanks, Father God, for coming through for me. Father God, I just want to tell you thanks for standing up with me. Father God, I just want to tell you thanks for the days when I was weak, you made me strong. Father God, some days I come on the live and I don't even know how to open my mouth. I don't even know what to say. But you give me words. You give me strength. You allow me to touch the donor them heart for them to be a blessing to this young miss. And all the house that I am giving over this Father God, I want to place them into your hand. Father God, if they have not yet known you and known you, dear Lord, and say the Father God, I am asking you to touch them, to show them that you are God and this could not be possible without you. Lord, Father God, I ask you to place your bloodstained banner upon this house every door pours and every window jam let the holy spirit rest here remain and abide in this house let nothing that is not of you come nigh this dwelling father god you must get the glory out of our life and you have placed little miss on the list she has been placed strategically on the program for her to get blessing but father god only thing that i am asking of little miss today to do is to know you as her lord and savior father god you know that we are not perfect but you you're perfect and perfect. You always straighten out the crooked. So little miss, I bring her before you this evening, Father God, and I ask your mighty God, might be not today, might be not tomorrow, might be not next week, now, might be not next month, but sometime, Father God, I ask you to touch her. Father God, I ask you to let her know that you are Lord and Lord of all lords. Father God, I ask you to let her come to see and to know that you are God and all that has been done here today. Father God, you are the one that I love. This is, this is more than a miracle. This is history. She did not know that one year time from Auntie Dana visit her, she would have a house and a place to call her home well furnished from a pin to an anchor. Father God, remember the donors them who make this happen. Father God, not only the one that donate money to the Father God, but the one that were donate prayer. Father God, the one that were stay up with me at night to talk about house and project. And today, Father God, I ask you for a supernatural blessing upon them. Father God, some of them sick, some of them don't even own a home but they make it possible for somebody else in Jamaica who is not related to them to have a house Father God and this evening we just want to give you thanks we just want you to get the glory out of this evening and we just want to give you thanks in Jesus name Amen Amen. Anything that you want to say? Any little miss? 
First and foremost, I want to say thanks to the Almighty who bring forth the blessing to me today. And I remember when I used to lie down, down there, down at the old house, before Auntie Dana come, and I used to lie down and I used to say to myself, don't take away my troubles, Lord. They only come to make me strong. But Lord, help me cross my rivers one by one. And, and, and this day, and this day, um, I see. I can't even talk. The way I feel emotional on social media, I can't. I'm right now, I'm nervous. How happy me is. Oh, um, as the Almighty God sent Auntie Dana along with the Planka Nation. A lot of time me I watch it and I'll read some of the comments them and me hear people are bash Auntie Dana and sometimes I don't know. Me don't know probably them different and me different, but how oh, come somebody if you have um, bust somebody like this? We go out to road, give poor people food to eat, to, to make me able to live somewhere like this today, yeah? And talk say people should take people money and them things. If she did take my money, this could be the year, so today, the year. A millions of dollars in Splanka Nation, and the money no go to waste. Thank you, Lord, for put trust in the Splanka Nation when I'm put a trust anti Dana with so much money, yeah, to make this possible. And to all of the donors, them from beginning up till now, we hear my story and go touch by the story. May the Lord guide you know, always in on the track, keep you always in on the car, and make the store back, it's basket never empty. Amen. Good evening. Good evening. Thank you for being a Thank you for being a big up. And thank you for the work that Auntie Dana done. People, yeah, people are going to say bad about Dana. But from Dana's side of the work, she do a lot when me say. And Dana, you can't stop people from talking. Yeah. If you do good, people yeah, talk. Talks, and yeah. if you do bad, people talk. But Dana, keep up the good work. Yeah. Keep it up. Yes, Hold on, somebody else will come. Yeah. Thank you, Auntie Dana, yeah. to bless my sister. Because we all are we are anywhere five of us and I'm glad to help her with our baby and everything. Out of the door. Oh God, thank you. We love you. We put her in our own home. Thank you. Sister, I'm glad for you. I have so many for you and your baby. Love you. That's what they said. Um, look at me say that I'll come. You want to say anything to the Planka people then? You're shy time. Thank you, Auntie Dana, and thank you, everybody, who help and love everybody. I'm not going to love you. Yes, you. Look at me, I'm your final donation here. Um, come, come here, look, we bring the baby in there. So, um, this person sent it to Miss Debbie, uh, Miss 50 US, and uh, uh, Miss Debbie gave me the equivalent. She named she, the person, she named Sean Marie. You went call her here for make sure you know her number on it. Mm -hmm. The Auntie Dana gave her the 6,005, and this is her number on the envelope. What me can come with it? Mm -hmm. Oh, different. Sean Marie. And this one, um, the lady someone must give the commiss the two thousand dollar. Her number also on it too. For a little miss from a single mother planting a seed in your life, two thousand dollar. All right, take the number, both of them number and the envelope. Thank you, Nation. Oh, go God ahead. God bless everybody again from the bottom of my heart. My deepest gratitude to each and everybody from start to beginning. That only for the donation, for all of the blessings and the prayer was sent out for me too as well. Amen. Alright, so we're going to come in, how much money the video on me?